Comet Swift Tuttle is one of the largest space objects to cross paths with Earth, stretching more than 16 miles wide, and in 1973, an astronomer predicted it would one day slam into a planet. It was initially thought that the comet would collide with Earth in 2126, triggering a disastrous string of events that would ultimately cause worldwide mass extinctions. Follow-up calculations have since determined that this is not going to happen, and the comet is instead expected to pass within 14 million miles of Earth. The initial prediction was made, and later retracted, by Brian Marston at the Harvard-Smithsonian Center for Astrophysics in 1973 based on limited observations, according to Live Science. After a sighting in 1992, plus additional data from 1862 and 1737, Astronomers confirmed that there would be no such collision in 2126. But if it did, they say the effects would have been catastrophic. The massive object passes by Earth roughly every 130 years, traveling about 36 miles per second. This is more than 150 times the speed of sound, and an impact with Earth would be 300 times stronger than the collision that wiped out the dinosaurs, Donald Yeomans a senior research scientist at NASA's Jet Propulsion Laboratory in Pasadena, California, told Live Science. Along with this, it would pump dangerous amounts of sulfur dioxide and then carbon dioxide into the stratosphere. The influx of these gases would cause cooling and long-term warming, respectively, resulting in a dramatic shift in Earth's climate. These changes would cause mass extinctions around the world, according to Live Science. It's also very likely that if it were to occur, it would land in the deep ocean, which would cause earthquakes and tsunamis, but not necessarily mass extinctions. Astronomers say Swift Tuttle is set to pass by Earth on August 5, 2126 at a distance 60 times that which lies between the Earth and the Moon, and isn't likely to come closer than 80,000 miles to Earth's orbit, though it will become less predictable over the next few thousands of years. Though it won't pass Earth for some time, Comet Swift Tuttle offers a reminder of its presence every year. The comet is responsible for the annual Prasad meteor shower, which will occur in mid-August. This year the event happens when Earth passes through the comet's debris trail, according to Space.com, and this year could produce an extraordinary show. While there are typically roughly 80 visible persits per hour, the 2016 meteor shower may see 150 to 200.